On Sunday afternoon, the Army women's soccer team hosted Bucknell. After a scoreless first half, Ruthie Rosenberger would go all out to give the Black Knights the lead. Goes far side, Staller. Thought about the deep pass. Now we'll send it up with the right foot. Here's Clegg on a foot race in the far side. No one there as she picks it up. Here's the senior pushing forward now. She'll cross with the right foot. Far side, almost knocked away, but it goes in. Ruthie Rosenberger just got a shoulder on it as she collided with Garkowski. McDermott was out of the frame. Rosenberger picking up her second goal of the season. They always tell me to get back post, and that's like my job when I go on. And so I know Dee can hit a ball pretty well across the goal, and I was just there, it hit off my shoulder. Like it always hit some like awkward part of my body, but it went in, so it was good. The Bison would respond with some chances of their own. After Courtney Nelson rattled the crossbar, Bucknell would attack the Army goal again. Held in by Bucknell. So two close shots for Bucknell after Army scored. Still 1-0 Black Knights. Turned in, and diving save by Monica Lee. What full extension on the shot by Denger. The senior would finish with four saves to preserve the win. The shutout is her 10th of the season and 17th of her career. The first half we kind of came out on our heels. Uh, second half we put in a really good effort. Um, they came at us pretty hard, but we kept composure and were able to pull it out at the end. After the match, head coach Stephanie Golan was happy with the way her team battled. We're going to have to do it again uh, another another weekend. You know, when we go down to uh, to DC and, and Annapolis, you know, we play Navy on Friday night, and then we're going to play American on on Sunday. And the American game uh, we anticipate being very similar. You know, it's going to uh, the Friday night game is going to be a tough game, and then uh, Sunday we're going to have to bring energy. We're going to have to bring that fight and that fire. So you know, we've been there and we've we've done it. So we we can bring the experience of having uh, having put those two performances back to back together. The Black Knights are back in action Saturday night at Lehigh. Reporting from Clinton Field, Rick Johnston, ITT Night Vision.